How you guys doing? How you guys doing? Uh, right. What you've been doing to keep sane during lockdown? Uh, I I started to like watch a bunch of old TV stuff, and I got a little exercise bike, and I started to ride that a lot. You've been going on a lot of walks. Yeah, I like going on walks. It's nice. Chris goes on like five mile walks every day. It's beautiful. Yeah, it helps with my drumming. That's true. <laughs> Um, I've been reading a lot of astrology books. Hell yeah. Uh, that, not just that. <laughs> not just that, but among other things, that's that's one. We've done a lot of music stuff. I mean, we have a new album that we have that we're finishing, mixing, doing stuff with. Exactly. Did we have any shows or tours that had to be canceled? Yeah. I don't think so. I think this was the first summer in like seven years or six oh, years true, that we yeah. didn't have like a tour that we were canceling because yeah. we were like gonna yeah. chill on the touring for summer because we recorded this is what chris was saying we recorded an ep in march mm. yeah <laughs> <laughs> so like right before lockdown hit like so we've been working on that working on that <laughs> i think we we had a couple shows that had to get canceled but they weren't like big tours or anything. oh yeah they were like, like I don't know, some festivals and stuff which makes me really fucking sad because i love music festivals in the Ooh, summer i l look forward to them the most yeah yeah this had happened yeah yeah i'm sure there's a question coming up about something that we were doing last year around this time <laughs> <laughs> Cincinnati has a very exciting music scene. Mm -hmm. Who are we excited about currently? Um, uh, always Loops this cool. band Lung. Yeah, Lung's great. Fruit Loops. Uh, Cream Boy. Cream Boy's great. Um, Sorry. Electric Boy. Citizen. Electric Citizen. Mm -hmm. 
Uh, Molly Sullivan. <laughs> kicked out, kicked out, kicked out. <laughs> is Kirsten in LA still? How is it there? The heat seems insane, and they sent us this, these questions. I think before the oh, yeah. fires even started. No, yeah, she still. Lives she's in there. LA. Yeah, she's doing well. She lives in LA. She's thriving so, there, but yeah. But it is really hot, and there are a lot of fires, and that sucks. But <laughs> she likes it out there still, in oh. spite of all that. But yeah, she is she's thriving. coming back. Sorry. No, she, she's <laughs> thriving. She's coming back for the holiday season. Yeah, she's coming back in December. Yeah. And we're all going to hang gonna out. Hang out a lot and do a lot, of, a lot of cool stuff together. Like, leggy stuff. Yeah. If my time is on this I will be famous in my 30s. It's the significance of knowing. It's the consequence of waiting. It's double cost of dying. Crunching on the tables about it where you went and what you enjoyed most it was amazing it was a really really fun tour i love that band i felt honored to be asked to support them on their farewell tour they're the fucking best and that yeah. was the best tour ever well really one of band. one of the best 
I would say my favorite tours we've ever done have all been in the UK. In the UK. Yeah. <laughs> like Shonen. Shonen and Spook School were like the two. The two. Big ones. Two of the best. But oh. it was, we went out, we, what was it, like three weeks? And after we did some shows with them, we also did some shows with Personal Best. Yes, on our label, Sherlock. Um, but it was great. It was really, really fun. We did, I don't know, a bunch of cities. <laughs> But it was cool. It was fun. We want to go back to the UK. <laughs> it was really fun to play some places that we had played on previous tours, and um, it w- it's really crazy to be a band from like Ohio, that's pretty DIY in a lot of ways. Like as far as when we tour over here, mm. and to be able to like have like have played like a a s- city the size of Cincinnati in the yeah. UK on the way, but like for the third time. Yeah, didn't we realize we played Leeds like, yeah, like four, three, times. four times? Yeah. Four times now we've played Leeds and we've played Indianapolis, which is like a mid-sized city, like, once. like an hour and a half away from us, one yeah. time ever. So that, <laughs> but it's because we'd of course rather be in Leeds. Yeah, and it's also a lot of, you know, <laughs> thanks to Dan Obley, like two of those. Yes, shout, shout out. out. Well, all, like so well, many, yeah. all of Pretty, the it all came together. The yeah. roots. It all came together. But yeah, that it was an incredible tour. It was really nice to see so many. They have a lot of like, uh, kind of like I feel like hardcore fans that are also like really genuine, cool people. Like that all came together. There are a lot, there are a lot of crying and bonding in the crowd. Yes, there's a lot of like young people at our most recent show. Yeah. It was like totally DIY at Leeds. But oh yeah, that, oh yeah, I just meant in general in the school, oh. school one because there were a bunch of like. Anyway, yeah, it was fun. festivals tend to fucking book a lot of like white dude bands um which is funny because i feel like we've been vocal so many bands have been vocal about it and popular opinion is like boards i feel like it's been like for like i i it's like a long time quote unquote but not but like for three years now it's like everybody's been fucking talking about this and yet i still see over and yeah, over the lineups not changing yeah which is really fucking like ridiculous because you'll also see labels some labels like literally their one post will be like hey like all of this very progressive stuff and then the next post will will be like here's our most recent band we signed like it's five white yeah. indie dudes like dude yeah. come on I don't, you know whatever yeah I know you mean. <laughs> yeah whatever. yeah I don't know, what's that? 
<laughs> Any upcoming band activities you want to mention? Um, we're gonna be doing a lot. We're gonna be doing some videos for like the songs that we have recorded. Should be fun. We're gonna do a handful of like self shot, you know, ones with friends. Yes. Like um, this... We've got a batch of songs that are coming out that are really great. Right? Really awesome. <laughs> We They're played two of them. We yeah, played yeah. two of them, obviously, in this. Yeah. The two songs in the middle, obviously, the ones I know he's heard, are <laughs> the, the new ones. Yes, who could uh, have ever thought yeah. such a thing? <laughs> but we're excited about those. It's, like, a little different than, like, some of the leggy stuff we've done before, so it's exciting to, like, you know, mm. get, get some stuff out there soon, especially with everything going on. Like, we can't tour, so we may as well work on this side. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs>
guess it's kind of time to wrap up, but I want to say happy birthday, Damably. Yeah, happy birthday, you, Damably. Thank you so much for everything. Yeah, you changed yeah, our yeah. fucking lives, honestly. Jordan's fucking realest heads in the world. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> fairy godfather and fairy godmother. Yeah, true. Thank you. Yes, Thanks thank for letting you. us do this. It's really fun. We love you. We love you all. Autobaki, Sesuni, Wesley, all of them. Hell yeah. Bye. Bye. <laughs>